Well, I'm going through images of uh, buffalo right now on uh, Google, trying to find anything that shows me head structure, uh, facial hair, body hair. I mean, look at the mo massive amount of hair on this uh, buffalo here. Of course, you get a lot of water buffalo stuff, but, oh, there's a great picture right there. Wow. I'll save that one. You can see I've saved quite a few. Nothing like uh, a buffalo growling during rutting season. season. Unbelievable. That's a good picture. I'm going to save that for future. So anyway, that's what I'm basically doing today. Uh, going through. I'm going to try to get to the uh, clay today, but I can't guarantee it because it, you have a lot of, you know, you, any sculpture that has to do with animals or people or whatever it involves a lot of uh, research a lot of looking if I had the uh, time I'd drive to Yellowstone Park and take a look at the buffalo down there but uh, oops let's see uh, it's hard to hold my cell phone and and do this at the same time. So I can't wait to get started on that piece. Oh, that's a good picture. I think I've got that one already. There's a good one. I got that one already too. You get a lot of repeats, but every once in a while you get a real gem of a photograph. Ah, water buffalo. Now, let's see. The buffalo, spirit and symbolism. Spirit, animal, symbolism, and meaning. Cats. A cat? What the hell is a cat doing in there? I mean, that's the one thing I dislike about Google search is you put a specific name in for searching and you get a dozen other subjects so anyway all right i'm going to continue doing this and uh if i get to sculpting i'll add that to this video if i don't uh, then that's what i did today look at the hair on that buffalo right there and when he's running that would be swept back by the wind I saved that photograph. I'm going to uh, put these on my cell phone so that I can have the images right there next to me as I'm sculpting. All right, that's what I'm doing today. And, uh, uh, more water buffalo. Oh, a rhino. Oh, okay, that's, that makes sense. You, you put in a search for buffalo, bison, photographs, or, you know, and stuff like that. You get a damn rhino. I saw a, a buffalo once behind a fence, uh, up near the the uh, Flathead Reservation, and I was standing there videoing it, and it came running and charging at me and hit the fence, and man, I, I fell on the ground. I mean, you have no idea how powerful that animal can be when it's charging at you. Good good picture of the uh, head of the horse, uh, the buffalo, not the horse. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Later.
give me a thumbs up and share my video and then check out my instructional DVDs uh, the link down below this video all right see you next time